All right. I guess we'll do the side story for lands today. Start off with that. So the first thing we got to do is head to the city. Now, the, I, I believe the city moved, so I don't really know where we're going to be uh, doing this. Or where, where, the, where the city is. So let's leave Agnes Castle. Maybe this might work. Because I'm not too sure where the city is now. So it's going to be a little bit of a fun time trying to find it. Oh, it looks like it's down there. Would it be somewhere here? Oh, it's over here. Okay, so it just moved over here. Okay. That's good to know. Airdrop. A little bit too weak to take that on. What? Okay, so it's not there. That's... What is this then? Oh, that's the... city be I think you've been Kevis Castle <laughs> what I'm very confused where do we got to go Go to the city's ground, training grounds. What? this here oh that's the fabricator I do not know where we have to go
I guess let's just travel to this region. We'll find it eventually. <sighs> what level are things in here actually? Yeah, level 70s. You know what? So it'll probably be the first time I'm actually going to use this, because I don't know where to go. Just fast travel here, maybe. <coughs> okay, so it's let's travel here. city is now. They said it was underneath. Oh, wait a minute. It's a level 87 unique monster. So, travel here, maybe? Okay, where is the city, man? <laughs> okay, so... Maybe... Let's just see if it takes us here. Okay, it wants us to go through here. So where the heck is it, then? Where would the city be? Okay, it still has us going that way. So... Hmm. see here no. 
now we just hang about. <sighs> I agree, Lance. <laughs> Your side story is going to be a giant pain. <clears throat> I just don't know where to find it, is the thing. Because it moved, so. Okay, so it's still not here. <clears throat> okay, so it looks like it's in this region then. Have we been over here? I don't think we've been over here yet. Yeah, we haven't been over here yet. <clears throat> What's over here then? Just out of curiosity. Pioneer's Inlet. Oh, nice. It's one of these. Send Let's send out the husk. Okay, let's see if lands can solve this. Okay. <clears throat> Okay, that's easy. <clears throat> Let's open these containers. Ooh, gold knock on coins. <clears throat> okay, I guess let's do the next one as well. Is it just going to be the same one, but... No, it's... Okay, um... <clears throat> there we go. No, I did not hear anything, Mio. I don't have great hearing like you do. I wish I did. Okay. What's this? This has gotta be worth a bunch. Odd round shard. More gold coin? Yeah, more gold coins. <laughs> How are we on ether? this pinned items uh 
Um. Let's see, do we have... silver um oh it's up at the top 81 yeah okay Oh, is it on the island that we marked we had earlier? Okay, I want to take a look at what this is. What this island is. Because I don't think we've been to this island either. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. this oh it's a we have been here fine okay I guess let's just go around yeah it's over here okay So that's where the city moved to. I was kind of curious on what that door was for. Now, now we know what that door is for, okay. Okay, so this takes us to the city now. <clears throat> I'm about to set off. Are you... <clears throat> Are your preparations complete? Go to the city? Yes. Yeah, we're ready. So I was talking to a friend about uh, the Xenoblade series and everything, and like how one uh, is my favorite game. But I, th when I was talking to him, I told him that I think three has overtaken one for me as my favorite game now, because it's just I I love one, but three is uh, really, 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 really good. So, he hopes that chapters uh, 4 and 5 live up to the expectations that myself and apparently a lot of others have set. Okay, so, the city. <clears throat> it's Boomer. Hmm, hum, hum, dang. 
Look, we <coughs> get that you're angry, but if you don't use your mouth words and tell us, we'll never know why. <coughs> hum diddy hum hum dang. What? You're not even angry. Come on, man. If you want to tell us something, just say it. Will you? Oh, there's a quest over there. My dream is... My dream is to someday become an adventurer and explore the whole outside world... Uh, outs world outside the city. Do you guys have a dream too? Um... I suppose our dream is to... Defeat Mobius? You know... If you're gonna have a dream, you should probably have one that's fun. <clears throat> you're still really young. Huh? <clears throat> Lance does want something a little bit meatier, of course. <laughs> so glad you lot made it through uh, Unshackled. Those Mobius were a cut above. I'm still reeling from all the excitement. Okay, let's see what this quest is over here. It's your novel after all. You're... It's, okay, so what are we going to get here? I'll tell ya. A novel book. Started playing a drinking game where I do some side quests and take a drink every time Uni says, I think Lance something meteor. <laughs> Bro, that sounds like so much fun. I think a really fun uh, drinking game would also be every single time Uni swears. <laughs> she has <laughs> such a mouth on her. <laughs> Oh, uh... uh... Are you alright? Someone counted, apparently Lance has more swears in total than Uni. Wait, really? Like, including side quests too? No, it wasn't third. I mean, after chapter... After what happened after chapter 5, I wouldn't necessarily be surprised about Noah. It's my chest. It kind of hurts to breathe. Oh, wait a sec. Group heal. <clears throat> it looked like it's still hurting. Oh, I love banana. Did it not work? If, the, if arts aren't, have, aren't having any effect, we should bring her to the medical facility. The doctor will know what to do. Right. Alright, we got another quest. Hell yeah. Shock to the system. <laughs> Group heal is just ineffective in the quest as, as it is in battle. True! Group heal... <laughs> I like Uni, but damn, is her class awful. <laughs> like, uh, what were the other... I don't remember what the other ones were off the top of my head. Uh... Izzard's class and Teach's class are so much better for healing, I found. Okay, let's... Yeah, I could see War Medic too. War Medic's pretty good. I do also like having piercing on uh, attacks too, though. Okay, let's see where this... Uh... And there's so much to do in the city. You're currently in Chapter 7. Yeah. How, how many hours have you put in already? Lance, you're a glutton for punishment, ain't ya? Don't tell me you like curious too. I wanna know all that trick to the trade. 
Only 53? Bro, that's that's like nothing. <laughs> I put uh I put almost 100 hours in so far. And I'm only still on chapter 6. But I I mean to be fair, I've also been like exploring everything as well as side quests too. <laughs> Fair. That's fair. I am also just taking my time and enjoying the game too, so... Six ain't many. Six of what now? The Ouroboros candidates. All that training and six get in. Oh yeah, Monica did say something like that to us. I feel kind of let down. How so? Just knowing there's a pecking order here too. Makes them the same. Same as us. People aren't equally suited to everything. Such is life. Sure. Thanks for the follow, my guy. I'm feeling hungry. You guys want to go grab a bite? I'm in favor. How about the shopping area? I found the tastiest looking torpedo stand. How's that sound? Torpedo rats, eh? Spark, yes. Lance? Yeah, sure thing. The director of Xenoblade 1 to 3 said he's planning on doing a 4. I mean, I guess it depends on how on how 3 ends. And like, I don't know about you, but th 3 right now is currently my favorite game of all time. It used to be 1, but god damn is 3 good. <clears throat> We were reassigned to the fact that the people seized while rescuing Gondor would take years to break out. But you Ouroboros made short work of that. Looks like the series is doing well enough for Nintendo not to shelf it. I mean, yeah, <laughs> look at every single other series of Nintendo's. <laughs> I do think though that two helped out a lot with that because one was like a cult classic. Metroid is only being made anymore because it's higher in the fan series. Yeah, true. I do think after two and three for uh for xenoblade was it definitely helps it out as well each member of the lost numbers is sort of a grandchild to me <clears throat> when they don't come back from a battle i'm so consumed with sadness i can't sleep so I'm very happy that so many of my little grandchildren were liberated from prison and made it back to the city. Thank you for getting them all back safe and sound. Someone bought enough Nintendo stocks to get on board and and ask about F-Zero. Yeah, uh, uh, I, I think it should at least have like one more game. I'm personally not too big of a fan for the F-Zero series. But I, I can see the appeal. But 
but then again, I'm just not really into racers. Have you seen what Mobius did to the Great Sword? How I, how on Ionis are we supposed to go toe to toe with that? I believe we could take them down with uh, Ouroboros' help, but I now I th <coughs> English man. <laughs> the answer was they don't have any ideas to innovate the series. I mean, that's usually what Nintendo tends to do. Because if they can't find some way to innovate, they just won't make a new uh, game in the series. Until now, Mobius never, or had never been able to determine the city's location. But now, thanks to certain traitors' actions, each and every one of us is exposed to danger. How are the Lost Numbers going to take responsibility for that, for what happened with Shania now? It's twenty dollars just to play Modern F Zero. <coughs> Plays just like Modern F Zero Two. I mean, yeah, that's fair. Direct attack upon city was not at all predictable. Big surprise. Because of this, Salmon predict more even unpredictable things. We'll hurry to prepare the to utmost and unforeseen unforeseeable circumstance. Huh. How do you mean? That is secret. I see it's in the city now. Your industry has been developing a game that's hey, yes, very inspired by Xenoblade. Here. Yeah, sounds How many fun. Times have I told you, no performing out here. Come on, man. Just trying to put on a little show for people. You shouldn't be wasting your time like this. Don't you have training? I'm not wasting my time. This is my job here. You call that a job? Hey, you're Ura Boris, right? I've heard. I suppose my job doesn't really compare to yours, I'll admit. Why are they on your case? Street performance. It's not allowed on this road. Street performance? This stuff. Around this spot, this is where you get the best crowds. <coughs> <laughs> but still, they like to push me around. We're at war here. Why aren't you fighting? They say. Do you not need to be fighting? The city's army is just for volunteers. <sighs> There's plenty who are willing. Why is that? Because it gets you others' approval. Hmm. Yeah, well, it would, wouldn't it? You think so? You don't? Well, who decides what has merit? And whoever's making the rules, how do we know they're right? Hmm. <laughs> I mean, I don't really know anything. It's just... Uh-huh. I think... Isn't it fine if there's, like, one guy who makes the call for himself? It's so little, man. Even if it ends up being pointless. Hey, even pointless things can have a point. Down the line. <sighs> I want to live my way. Take it one step at a time, the way I want really live hell yeah brother who doesn't <laughs> oh rats better scarf up before the guards find me again <clears throat> hey tell you what i've got a new trick 
Just in the works. You should come and watch. Bye. Sounds fun. You okay there? Can I help out? Nah. I'm all good. I totally believe you, Lance. Lance! This alarm's worrying. Head for the war room. Right. On it. Combat is like Dark Souls games. They also have arts. Party members anger and shake attacks. There are a lot of good game design principles to learn from these games, as well as some pitfalls to avoid. I mean, yeah, sure, that that goes for like most games too, though. You got yourself a real fan club, eh, Kryto? <clears throat> Everyone seems to go wild for you. Yeah? I guess I do get a buzz of energy uh, from my fans for... For that, I'm really grateful. I can show people there's hope in surviving. Then I can fight any battle. Oh yeah, I reckon I'm starting to understand the whole Kryto effect now. Where are you, Yunil? What? Yeah, I wonder when we'll hear more about uh, Breath of the Wild 2. I really want, to, want it to come out. Because I did have my problems with 1, but I still really enjoyed 1. <clears throat> So the city was a Pharaonis this whole time. I had no idea. <clears throat> the fact that it could move was just as much as a, of a surprise. It's a surprise to me that there's anything that you don't know. Miori. It means there still might be more of a more uh, city secrets to be discovered. Might be delaying it for the next console, just like Breath of the Wild 1. I mean, maybe. They also could potentially want to put a lot of polish on it too. Because Zelda is one of their biggest series. This only happened because the Elder Outsiders come and go into the city willy-nilly. Still, we were able to live in peace for all this time until now. There's no small feat to think about. I love how this game just shits on conservatives. It's so funny. Oh, there's another quest-related event. I imagine that's upstairs. Yeah, I think it's upstairs. Oh, hell yeah! We've seen everything? Awesome. Not sure if it fills out the map like in one. Okay, let's see what this is. <coughs> now. Ah! Well, let's not be hasty, mate. Hmm. He goes flat. Excuse me? People walk up above. I wonder if there's any... <coughs> I wonder if you'd help me out a tad. I see now where the mix-up came. Uh, to pass. You must have thought I meant to end my life. I only meant to do some practice falls. <laughs> what? <laughs> Bro, you're insane. You see the war room waiting there below. <clears throat> uh, so there was never any uh, cert 
<laughs> or concrete risk. Friend land on anything <clears throat> friend want, but from this height, death not optional. Why would you even want to do this? To gain permission f f for my true love's hand. Hand? What hand? Her hand. My dear, in marriage. Nothing less. A jeweled pebble's <clears throat> what a suitor needs if he's to have his marriage recognized. So I have promised thus to bring one home. I see. So a marriage necessitates finding this pebble. They must think he actually <laughs> wants to take her hand. <laughs> Probably, because, like, you know, the whole, like, marriage and kids thing is, like, very unheard of for them. Outside of, like, what Noah saw through N's uh, memories. And I guess Mio as well. Our problem's really of another kind. You see, our family st uh, standings are... Uh, of such. Ah, uh, wait, you're outsiders, are you not? My lady love is of a noble house, and their old-fashioned representative is not inclined to bless our wedding wish. I begged and pleaded for a hundred days, and finally the answer came back yes. So you need to find a jeweled pebble to prove your worth. But what does that have to do with f flinging yourself from high places? A jeweled pebble's only found one place. Uh, Lavi Sandbar is, is uh, the place it sleeps. A site in yonder Erythia Sea. The sandbar, though, may prove a testing task at f far removed from the city fairs it lies. It sh its shores reached only by with one boat. Of course, it hasn't. I haven't access to a boat, so swimming is the only choice I have. I just want to hooker down in the city that will eventually be found, and I have no resources to defend myself, but probably won't <coughs> happen to me, <laughs> the people against lost numbers. True! I mean, you hear that all the time, you hear a similar thing all the time in, in real life too, as well, though. I estimate I can swim, well, uh, I estimate the swim will take 10 days, so till then I must fortify myself. And what more bracing action can there be than leaping from some high up lonely place? Pandora's box has been open too late to go back for that. I mean, yeah, that's true. To a certain, to a certain point, yes. Uh, the Nopon of the caravan it was, who told me of this brilliant technique. I hear that it's a well-respected way to get a marriage recognized, in fact. I mean, maybe for, uh... Maybe for Nopon, yes. I... I see. And that is why, my friends, I tell you true. You needn't worry <clears throat> over this man here. My trading has begun in earnest, yes. My Jolita waits f for my success. Your Jolita is going to be waiting 
a long time if you kill yourself jumping off high things, mate. <laughs> Romeo? <laughs> oh, is this a is this a Romeo and Juliet thing? Oh my god. You said your pebbles all you need. Correct. We have our own vessel. We could take you on a trip to Lavi Sandbar. You will? But the ship, the trip's much less than 10 days long. I'd be so grateful if you'd help me out. And where might we find this Lavi Sandbar? I'll send your iris the whereabouts the target lies. It won't be long now till my goal is reached. Sweet Julieta. Wait a little more. I mean, bro, she was gonna be waiting a long time for anyways, so... Proposing marriage, awaiting wants approval from. Oh, Garrett, I see. Let's just travel back here. A cradle transport for the colonies? Yes. The report is calling it large scale. And you want to liberate it? Like you did that last batch? Right, well, that explains the emergency assembly. When? Where? By our estimate, tomorrow, late night. Pedesto Valley floor, at the Great Swords base. Boss, the logistics guys wanted an overnight camping kind of deal. Approved. Sort out the planning. Just what I thought you'd say, so I took initiative. We can leave any time. What do you think? Should we lend them a hand with it? Yeah. Gladly. If Monica's okay with it. It's up to you. But if things don't go to plan, there might be a fight. Of course there will be. We're prepared for that. Hmm. Then be my guest. Take this chance to show my soldiers that Ouroboros spark. It'll be an illuminating experience for them, fighting or not. All right. We'll drill them well. I thought Monica said farting, not fighting. That would be a little bit more, uh, awkward. Uh, what do I do again? What's this? Oh yeah, that's right, that's what that is. I already saw that. Oh, we can probably just go there. That's the power of Council F. Oh, is that who we're gonna be fighting? Oh, we can't do that in here. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Me and my himbo brain. Uh, if that was the power of Council, Council F, that would be hilarious. Things used to be easier, huh? What was? All we had to do was bash heads. No thinking, no nothing. What about the dying part? You weren't scared? Sure, I was scared. But at least I knew what was expected of me. Wait a sec. You want to go back to that? Obviously not. Just saying how I feel. There's just too much snuff to consider nowadays. It's doing my nutting. I think you should try it sometime. <laughs> the thing might not be so bad. God not damn it, making it sound like I don't. You just said it yourself. No thinking, no nothing. I was talking about before, you spoon. <laughs> Sorry, who are you calling a spoon? Who calls someone a spoon? 
you're gonna act like a spoon, of course I'm gonna call you one. Uh, it takes one to know one. What? Let's just chill out here, you guys. Okay, then why don't you tell me where we are now? What's this region? Come on, spill. Uh, it's, uh... See? You can't tell your ass from your elbow. Doesn't that make you the spoon? Just because I slept through that class, if I've been awake for it, right. then... Things were easier. Then stay awake, you spoon! Yeah. We had everything handed to us. Back then. That's not quite true in your case, though, is it? What? You had thoughts. And deep ones at that. I can tell. When we're playing together. That you had, as well. I hope... we find an answer. Absolutely. We'll find it. I'm sure. Hope so. I love... I love the insult of calling someone a spoon. <laughs> Should do that. This power of sp farts spread for miles. It gets banned by the Geneva Convention? Probably. <laughs> Lance, empty head, no thoughts. True! <laughs> Oh man. The Podesto Valley floor is ahead. The camp's a stone's throw from the great sword. <laughs> oh my finger, man. It hurts like crazy. Hey guys! Hmm? It's an honor. I mean, this <coughs> chance to do a knot with you guys. What do you mean? You're my heroes. Uroboros. I mean, I always knew a grunt like me could never measure up. Although, we all still dreamed of it. And now you're here in the flesh. Doesn't seem real. What's so great about us? Huh? Before this op's done, we might have to kill old friends. How about it? Could you do it? Stab a friend? Lance! Bro. I... I mean, that's... If you're here with some half-assed notions, go home. I... I... Yeah, I'm sorry. I just got excited. They talk big, but... When shit hits the fan, they might just double-cross us. You watch. <laughs> you saying you can't trust us with the job? 100%. You never trained with our unit before. Never ever fought by our side. The way I see it, you're just some arse wipes who stole away what was rightfully ours. <sighs> oh yeah? If I let you down, shoot me. In the front or back, I don't care. Bro. <laughs> Gee, thanks. Well, that's awful big of you, pal. <laughs> the hell? <laughs> Lance had some balls, Jesus. <laughs> I'm sorry. Maybe we shouldn't have come. No, this is good. It's how you build trust. You can only begin once you've gotten everything out in the open. Really? One of my dad's favorite lines. Wasn't it the same for you lot? Oh, flashbacks. Got all of them. Yeah. You might be right on the mark. I'm sure they'll settle down when they need to. They've got good role models today. That's good. <laughs> Calling someone spoon. <laughs> now to cock for a term. <laughs> for a group of people who <clears throat> people one doesn't like, we call them spoons. Because you can't trust them <clears throat> with a knife of the f fork. I mean, okay, that makes a little bit more sense. It's also a way of calling someone shallow, uninformed, and dumb. Alright, well, I guess you'd learn something new every day, right?
All right, let's see what we got over here. Oh, it's a uh, Veronis. Okay, I see. Oh, it's one of the Mobius ones, I think, right? Intel was right. There's quite a few of them. But it's too quiet. There's barely any signs of life. They're probably all conked out. The fewer sentries, the better for us. Monica, the cradles are in that transport. Yes, it's likely. Let's Watch head down. <laughs> Watch if out for the smell. From the right, we can approach unseen. <laughs> Don't worry, brother, I will. Roger that. Bro, why am I getting an email for that now? That was like hours ago. If it's all like this, then this will be a cakewalk. Let's try not to get ahead of ourselves. Okay. Kind of wish there was. <clears throat> there were more joke councils. I mean, yeah, me too. I think the most interesting, or one of the most interesting, is uh, Council T, because he literally joins you. I think its X is also pretty interesting too. The one from Uni Side Story. What is this? They're all empty. Yeah, he is a free agent. Also, okay, it was funny. Did we just fall for a trap? What, uh, what side quest was he from again? They've got us surrounded. Oh, no. Well, doesn't it suck to be you? Every little step you made turned out exactly as planned. Wait, what? Now, us, we're an elite unit, the all stars of Kevin. Oh, he's from Ethel. So, okay. Doing as you please for long enough. Right here, right now, we're gonna correct that little mistake. Gob! Oh! So you've actually heard of me. Guess I gotta give myself more credit than I thought. Layla and who? Sparks. They look like they're in their early terms. That means... They got reborn. That adds up. This lot, soon after they moved to Colony 8, I hear they croaked. Well, isn't that great? Don't dare look down on us second-termers. We were chosen. We are the elite. Uh-huh. Where have I heard I that before? I lost numbers or what. But you're in our way, and for that, your heads are gonna roll! Oh, this is gonna be incredibly easy. I thought this was going to be a lot harder. Okay, let's see here. <laughs> Beating up literal 12 year olds. Hell yeah. My, my dream. <laughs> Gotta love beating up 12 year olds. Okay. 
That's it? I thought I thought they would put up more of a fight than that. Just finish them off already. I need that sweet, sweet light. <laughs> yeah, I don't really like that sentiment. <laughs> Teachers in the nineties sucked. Or the the nineteen hundreds, I should say. That'll give me a good top up, nice and easy. Gotta love this new flame clock the console was kind enough to give us. It's a belter. It's a different color. Yeah, that is no ordinary flame clock. Back in my old colony, if some moron slowed you down, there was nothing you could do. Oh, you could kill him, sure, but you wouldn't get any life from it. But around here, that's all changed. Here, life is the privilege of the strong. The final survivor gets to take the whole snuffin cake. Gothel. You get it now, do you? The weaklings need to be taken out of the running. So give me some of that sweet life. I... Ow. You mother. You can call yourself a leak all you want, but, but do, do moderate, moderate your expectations. Your expectations. Huh? <laughs> the same as ever, Gov. Only ever thinking of yourself. How are you, you gonna, gonna win against, against us like, like that? that? Uh, uh, the snuff is this? No one told us about these monsters. You are not to hesitate. Oh, here comes the cancel to the... <laughs> Riku, meh! <laughs> what? Are you... Lady Consul! I should have Riku is a Giga Chad. I suppose I ought to have prepared better still. A woman? You like my children? <laughs> They're an anti city special unit. One that I have diligently raised and lavished with love myself. It has been backbreaking to educate them so. I think I've seen her before, right? They'll have to earn much, much more life for me before they're done. I hate failed investments. So you see... I'll take you brats out myself to protect mine! <laughs> Come on, Lance, it's 2022. <laughs> True. Try me then. I'll show you. Council H. Come on, Noah, smash. There we go. All right. Ice Maiden. Really, Noah? Really? You're 10 levels higher, my guy. Oh, 
Nice. Who's getting hurt? Really? The frame right after, bro? You can't beat my mashing seals, come on. So much ice. She must be the ice queen. Come on. How are you almost dead, Mio? Nice. Uh, almost time. Uni. All right, let's do it. Wait. Oh, God damn it, Mio. Okay, let's see here. Uh, that. Easy. Nice. Wait, how is Uni almost dead? Okay. Nice. Let's see if that's enough. gonna be close come on oh finally I wasn't sure if we were gonna be enough nice perfect
There we go. Unfortunately, life isn't fair. What just happened? The, the console, she... She just disappeared. Lady console? Lady console? What... What am I supposed to... Ow! Lands! You can't do that! <laughs> Your clock's gone. Just stand down. Peace. You don't have to fight anymore. Huh? No more stealing of lives. No more charity from consuls. What are you on about? Get snuffed. You're talking out your ass. Don't have to fight. Fighting is all that we know. If we don't have that, then what the snuff are we supposed to do? Tell me, what do we do now? It's for you to figure out, my guy. Hey, need some help? Huh? Oh uh, yeah, nah, been through worse. Man, you guys, stunning. You're so far beyond us. Ah, uh, it's not a big deal. If you're one of us, you did just as well. Cap. I think they'll be okay, those guys. What's eating you, Lance? Well, I just worry we cut them loose a bit soon. A little bit. Tell me, what are we going to do now? How would I know? Huh? You stop stealing lives. You guard them. It's simple. But the how is up to you. Got it? Spark? You can't do this to us. Colony 4. Know it? Yeah. I've heard about it. On your map, middle of the Faunus region. The lieutenant there, Boliaris. You can tell him we sent you. Try him. Helps to have a mentor, starting out. I mean, it's, I guess that's a good starting point. You gave him the info. Now they got a choice. Some might take it hard, though. Besides, when we cut through the flame clock, it was to protect the city detachment, too. There was little else we could do. If we'd meddled even more, it might have come right back round to bite us in the bum. We did the right thing by telling them about Colony 4. I think that was the best course of action. <coughs> Everything they believed came crashing down just like that. They'll be confused for a while, sure. But they'll figure it out. Just the same as you lot did. It's the same with the economic collapse. If we hadn't met like we did in that valley, we'd be just as confused as those guys. Luck was on our side. Speaking of, back then, wasn't it Lance who was the most reluctant of us? <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Our big man was just a bit shy to introduce himself in front of new people. <laughs> right? <laughs> uh, shut up. Oh, yeah, he was. I did kind of get the impression that he was embarrassed to speak up. Right? Eh? Oh, he's just a big teddy bear, really. <laughs> oh, Uni, you love just digging in, don't you? Okay, it looks like this is quest Here, is finally Lance. done. Same dish as mine. Double Arden meat, deluxe. Ah, thanks a bunch. Ah, oh, let's see. No tall spice here, but double veggies. Arden sausage, huh? That sounds good. But then, there's the tall spice sauce as well. 
Mmm, fluff cream and skeeter syrup dressing. What delight. Oh, there's even chocolate sauce. How can I possibly choose? <laughs> Come on, Tyon. <laughs> Still hard to believe, huh? Eating what we want. Huh? But is it enough? I want more. Dude, that's already pretty hefty. You really gonna eat another? I got it backwards. Huh? Maybe it has to start with me. Well, I guess that's that quest done. Every guard can now reach level twenty. Okay, let's see what else do we got here. Anyone level up their classes? Tyon's close. Okay, uh... Alright, I want to go out here. Okay, what do we have currently equipped now? Increases attack by 25. Um. Hmm. Yeah, we don't have enough SP to really do anything else. I think that's good now. Getting brighter now. Yes, uni's the boss. Let's put more of Mio. Okay. Uh guess let's do this one. Thanks to what you did, not only Lee uh, Gretton prison camp, but the Agni the castle itself has been liberated. That's Ouroboros' power. That revolt was a long time coming. Now I've got to rid that <clears throat> or ride that momentum. Yeah, right on. So, the bunch who got captured by Agnes made it back here. Incredible. I thought once they got captured, they were gone for good, and I'd never see them again. This is truly a truly happy... This is a truly happy and uh, awe-inspiring... Or awe-inspiracious occasion. Better have... A drink to celebrate. Does he ever not drink? Uh, good question. <coughs> okay, let's do this quest, I guess. Ah, this again. Have you seen it before? 
since the city has moved locations, the people have had to attune to a completely new environment. Patients keep being rushed in because their bodies are weakened by the change. Oh, hey, Monica. I didn't realize there were so many patients. You seriously didn't expect this to ha this would happen? Obviously, I understand that we had to move to avoid being wiped out by Mobius. But moving to a place... Moving to a place a whole 2,000 meters below ground level. Okay, that's enough. I know the remedy. As long as we get the medicine, everyone will be right as rain. Heh, <laughs> wishful thinking. I'll send for extra medical supplies. Let us know if you need, or what you need. <clears throat> I will, thank you. Right then. Doc, is there anything we can do to help? There is. If patients keep coming in at the current rate, we won't be able to provide enough medicine. Could you gather some egg seeds and heavy uh, pomegranates for me? You'll find them in the Kenstadia... Uh, the Cadencia region. Oh, and Rokodori roots as well. That's indigenous to Lavi Sanbar. If you could prepare 20 of each for me, I think we, we'd have enough for a surplus of medicine. Okay, we'll be back with the goods quick as you like. Sorry about this. All right, let's see how they're doing. At odds with. Oh no! <laughs> no! We actually have to go collect stuff. Oh, that's gonna be really annoying. So you know, <clears throat> they charted the Van Dam person to the Doyle of medical facility. What do you think happened then? Given the House of Rodels is the neutral party. I'm sure he would have saved both. It's a terrible offshoot. The houses... Six houses... Let's see. There's so much to do in the city, man. Oi, Zach. <clears throat> How's it going? Great, thanks for asking. I learned a new trick, and it seems to be going down a storm with everyone. Hey, do you know uh, Mizuki, by the way? We happen to be acquainted. I feel like I could lift everyone's spirits, just like I did for him once. Perhaps it's con consent or er, consented of me but I feel like I was able to achieve something that only I could do. We've made some new friends. Oh, so that's how they're doing. Gondor is safe. Monica isn't really letting it show, but she must be relieved. You know, Monica never once mentioned that Gondor was her daughter. That was one spark of a surprise. Well, she has her position as Elder. She wouldn't want people to think that personal feelings were getting in the way. My position is somewhat similar, so I can understand her point of view, but I worry she takes 
it to an extreme sometimes. Oh, so that's how they're doing. Our imprisoned friends made it home. You lot did something truly great for us there. But we didn't manage to save all of them. But that isn't on you. <clears throat> they must have been at least somewhat prepared for that. From the moment that they got captured. And now... And now that infer uh, Infernal Prison is no more, that's going to make moving around a lot easier for me too. I'm going to make the most of it for our dear friends who never made it home. Good for you. Shania stabbed us in the back. I can't believe it. Damn it all. I thought <clears throat> of her as a friend, but I guess she didn't feel the same way. Oh, so that's how they're doing. Laments. Okay, let's see. Maybe this will open up another quest. It's been so hard for Gray's wife having to wait for him to return. I feel for her. Gray's always been leaving her behind to go on missions, risking his risking life and limb for the city. Gray's, yeah, that might open up a new quest. Okay, let's see here. Uh, I always knew that the city itself was a Pharaonis. The real shocker was finding it can still move. Must have been considerably confidential for you to know that. Know about it, but not Shania. The founder of my house was something special. I think even among the six houses, only a few people knew about the truth. It very well could have been the case. Mizuki. Attacking the castle and freeing our imprisoned comrades at the same time? It's amazing what you Ouroboros can do. I really think that I'd never see my friends again. Thank you so much. Alright. I think that's everyone in here, right? Now can we open this door? No, it's still locked. And we do got another thing. Looks like it's over there. There might be people over there that have new dialogue as well, so we can take a look. If Kevis and the Annihilator had an Annihilator, it would have... <clears throat> being wise to assume Agnes has one too. It's fair to say mistakes were made. I never would have imagined the city itself could move. But in any case, you Ouroboros did yourselves proud out there. Okay, uh... You did really well out there. 
the results even better than I had hoped for. We exposed the city to some danger, but the reward f far outweighed the risks. You even smashed the castle's flame clock. That's hard. That's hard to credit. Yeah, for sure. Did they go down? I guess that person gave me the slip. Gigi said you go out at night time. Is there a reason for that? <clears throat> Must be kind of inconvenient in the dark. In daytime, I'm usually helping out grandpa or grandma at the shop, so it's hard for me to make friends because of that. The only person I get to talk to is Gigi. He's a customer in the shop. So I get better inspiration for my puzzles at night. I had no idea that the city could move, but uh, move about like that. I was so surprised my head nearly fell off its shoulders. We seem to be cropping or, or coping j just fine though. The great s sword might be broken but the city's safe, and that's what matters. I think we've escaped the worst of it, but we're not quite out of the woods yet, which is still a little worrying. Not everyone is as strong as you. We need to support each other if we're going to conquer fear and insecurity. Wise words. It's funny, I only have to play tag for like two minutes and then I'm super sweaty. <laughs> You're moving about, love. But that's what makes you sweat. What's funny about that? I never used to sweat. I think it's just got a bit too warm in the city. After everything moved. The city used to be right at the top of the Great Sword. I wonder if that would account for the difference in temperature. Absolutely. That absolutely would. Okay, I think there's a side quest over here now. Might be down. I hate the way you are. Yeah, there's a side quest over here. Perfect. What do you got, Travis? Well, well, well. A personal visit from Mobius's most wanted. I'm not sure how I feel about being labeled like that. For the lost numbers, this would be a new, uh, the highest conceivable honor. Your reputation alone's dealing Mobius massive, a massive blow here. Anyhow, here you go. Auto balancer. So Mobius aren't as united as they make themselves out to be, eh? Not so different from our Senate. <clears throat> I keep hearing this word Senate, but I don't actually know what it means. <coughs> it's a committee made up of the six houses. Sure, they've always blocking this or that, 
but you're also they're also a storehouse of you know of know-how when they aren't squabbling over ideology they share their knowledge and set a different direction for the city the one with ultimate responsibility we call the the elder just one of many burdens the boss is shouldering right now that's fair That's most of it, right? Okay, is there anything new in here? Still can't go past there. Okay. Uh... Is that Gigi? That is Gigi. Come on, Gigi. Just talk to me. City changed location so suddenly. Five plates breaking G home of Gigi. Gigi of... Or it's... <laughs> for... Compensate. <clears throat> but they... Yell 100 plates break here. All Gigi get is shouted at no money but somebody always worse for wares yes so giggy feel much sorry and help to tidy up big mess okay i'm sure that there's going to be m more of a I'm sure there's going to be more quests over here. There has to be. Um. <clears throat> oh. It is not. A lot of level 60s, though. Damn, Mio. Healers are down. Okay, let's uh, not go there. Uh, I think Colony 4 should have the, the new guys from Colony 8, I believe it was. <coughs> Just see. Whoops. Oh, hey, you lot. You came at the right time. We got our hands on some high-quality meat recently. Care to try some? Oh, 
You mean from the huge armu you hunted? Yeah. Hey, how did you know that? Is that why you came here in the first place? Well, uh, we just heard you had some first-rate fillets, and then we couldn't stop thinking about them. So, <laughs> so it is why you scalped yourselves all <clears throat> all this way. Didn't expect you to have such a base of motiv a base motivation. Gotta say. Our apologies. If we've offended, we'll just go. Ah, uh, it's f fine. We all we already decided we'd treat you for thanks for your help. So yeah, grab some seats and I'll bring it out right for you. I've got plenty of first-rate fillet you want so much <clears throat> and it's got your names on it Phew, I'm stuffed don't think I've had such a tasty meat in all my life oh yeah me too I'm almost tearing up over how good it was it definitely earned that first rate part it melted on my tongue like some kind of huge juicy meaty snowflake indeed I won't be forgetting this anytime soon <laughs> well great feedback glad to see my hard work didn't go to waste that was super delicious thank you so much for everything <coughs> hmm? Something wrong? Uh, what? M my body feels numb. Hey, what's going on? Stay with me. Somebody, come quick. I need a med team here, stat. Ugh. Is everyone all right? I don't feel right at all. My body feels wrung out. Uh, I feel like I'm gonna puke. What the spark happened? It seems we were transported to the medic team after losing consciousness. Let's ask... Well, Shandra, what happened? She might know something. Ah, what a relief. Looks like you're back on your feet. How do you feel? My head still feels a bit fuzzy. Any clue what happened to us back there? Actually, about that, I'll tell you. But please try not to freak out. To be truthful, we... We found traces of poison in your in the food you ate earlier. Poison? Relax, please. It won't have any lasting effects, thanks to how quickly you received treatment. So does this mean that... Uh, Laszlo guy put poison in her dinner? He's actually being questioned by Bully Allers in command right now. We should go there, too. <clears throat> what did he... What did he was awful? No matter how you slice it. Yeah, there's no gray area around this. We can't... Let this slide. Hmm. Okay, but we still got some topics to discuss. I've been craving some downtime. <coughs> oh yeah, that's right. We need that white fog still. Let's 
have it at Huddle Up. Gray, you come from the city, don't you? Yeah. No need to be so standoffish, mate. You're allowed to talk, you know. Don't usually bother with trivial stuff. So you have a wife, don't you? Do you want to go see go and see her? Fine either way. Come on, that's no good. She'll want to see you. Ugh. So can you can always drop in a while you're giving the report to, uh, for the lost numbers. Oh yeah, you kept all <coughs> that about the lost numbers quiet, didn't you? I told you I don't talk about unimportant stuff. <coughs> I cannot believe this bloke. Let's have <clears throat> let's have let's have it out then. Proposal. Let's go and see this wife of yours. Ugh. I'm taking your silence as a yes. Good work, team. Let's go. Lovebirds. Okay, okay, let's slay it out all at once for... Let's slay it out, out and for all. This house... Orts it's working with Monica's family, the Van Dams. And oppressed... Uh, opposed to them are the Doyles, uh, people who call themselves conservatives. <laughs> And keeping in the middle ground is how between them is house road is is that right? And city politics is confusing. As all get out <clears throat> I mean not really. And that's why they're opposing each other in the first place. They're called city people, aren't they? The more people in a community, the more opportunity for ideological div divides. I think this is one of those. Though they share a common goal, they disagree on the best way to achieve it. I have some experience with that. There is bound to be some story behind the story. <laughs> One that we don't know. It's always something like that. Indeed, we should... Indeed, we should tread more... We should tread carefully whenever we have to deal with them. That does seem prudent. If we misstep, <clears throat> we might become embroiled in a conflict as well. Oh, hello, Morgan. How's it going? I still hope one day everyone can work together as one. Is that naive? Uh, I'm okay, I guess. Shall we put our heads together on this? Some things are a little bit better. I mean, I, I'm starting to get some feeling left or feeling back in my finger again, so it's. I guess that's good. It's understandable that people are stressed and worried. Uh, what with everything that's happened. That's encouraging. Yeah, a little bit. I mean... I, I can still see where where things had happened on my finger, so it's not, uh, it's not that fun. And it's still a little bit numb, too. Am I playing Splatoon 3 next week? I haven't played 1 or 2, and I don't think I'll be playing 3 either. 
it's just not a game for me. Plus, also, Xenoblade 3. I have over 100 hours into it, so... Or, or at least... Probably around 100 hours. Yeah, no, no worries. It's just, it's just not a game for me. The city folk are really starting to get in arms about it. be doing a 16 hour stream next weekend of the game I mean that's fair I did a fairly long stream for Xenoblade 3 when it came out on release day so yeah that was fun I guess raids were normal for us back in the colonies we just took that kind of thing for granted to them, fighting was something that happened on the outside world. How was the game, by the way? Like Xenoblade 3? Uh, let's just say 3 has surpassed 1 for me. And the thing with 1 is it was my favorite game of all time. So, it's really good. If you haven't played either one or two, though, some stuff might not make sense, but it's... this I've been really loving this game. Uh, chapter... 5? Actually got me to cry. To them, fighting <clears throat> was something to happen in the outside world. I've heard mixed reviews about it. I'm happy to see. Really I can at, at start two. I mean, every Xenoblade flat, every Xenoblade fan that I've talked to has really been enjoying three, uh, past chapter three. Because I imagine those negative reviews are more or less just coming from chapter one and two. Because, you know, that's still, like, the start of the game. But once you get into the meat of the game, like, three onwards, it's really good. Just started two. I finished two on the day before three released. And I think two is the weakest in the series. Like, the only... Really, the only things that saved 2 for me, in my opinion, was Pyramithra, uh, Zeke and Pandy, and Morag and Bridget. Outside of that, everything else, like... And the combat was okay as well, I guess. Uh, 2 is just... 2 is really weak, in my opinion. You can understand how seeing one of their fundamental beliefs shattered, it's going to be <clears throat> going to cause some unhappiness. Suppose. But then you've got those conservative types who were already afraid of this kind of thing would happen. Seems like they're already in a state of panic. <laughs> That's how they work. Right, everything feels quite uh, precarious right now. I hope everyone in the city is okay. Have you played Three Hopes yet, or are you just onto this style of games? I have not played Three Hopes yet. I want to, but it's kind of hard right now uh, due to my f financial status changing so suddenly. Which, uh, you know, I made some calls. And some places were not really too happy about what had happened on Tuesday, so... I'm gonna be looking into it. To say the least. Can't really go into details about it, though. For obvious reasons. Should 
Should we maybe talk to Monica and Travis about it all? I think we should. I hope we can do something to help. <coughs> <coughs> Choices. Novel spoken. and we can't do that one yet. Let's have a little huddle up. A novel. They're all the rage in the city. Some kind of book or something. I don't know. Justice will be had. I sure hope so. But I guess time will tell. And I'll... Be looking for something else in the meantime as well. I have to be a little bit more... Uh, stingy with... What I'm going to be looking for though. Because... My knee injury... As well as uh, my my finger being a little bit numb too, so yeah, it was it wasn't fun. The good the good thing is is it didn't you know the thing that had impaled me didn't hit anything major. As well as it went clean through, so that's that's good. Got a fight spreading. <clears throat> I got a fight, uh, a speeding ticket in the next week or so myself. Got caught speeding apparently when I was going, <laughs> making a turn. Wait, how fast were you going? A book can't. A <coughs> <coughs> book can't that can't be that good then. Oh, lands you meathead. I get the feeling they're pretty different from the textbooks we used to read. Oh, how different. Or different how. I don't know the details. Are you curious though, Mio? Just a little. We should read one of these novels and see what it's like. Cup say one twenty, but I'm sure that's impossible. Having my, <laughs> I do, <laughs> I do think you over exaggerate things a little bit too. To be fair, <laughs> but also like fuck the cops though. Cops are useless in a lot of aspects. Um. Yeah, on a on a different note, note though, I have been casually talking to an animator that I enjoy. Like she and I have been uh, been chatting for a good couple weeks now. She's very nice. Yes, let's see if we can find one to buy in the city. Okay, I think that's all the quests that we can do now. Yeah, we need to get the other white fog. We have to keep track of our progress. 92 hours. Let's go. Let's order that. Okay. Let's change the quest around, I guess. Uh I think do that yep 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 
Have you been doing anything interesting? As of later, no. Not really. Okay, let's see here. Might be something new up over here. Bro, what's this? Okay. Experiments, explosions. <clears throat> Expedisis, explosion. I'm so sorry. I'm so pleased you all made it, Orbors. Yeah, good for us. Now give back our authorization. We and we'll say no more about it. Oh, I don't care what you have to say about it. Be a sweetie and help me with an experiment, would you? What? Don't bother, Lance. You won't get through to her. Looks that way. Let's make it easier and give her a good walloping without feeling bad about it. Oh, did we now? Nice. This is easy. Easy. How did you not die from that, Mio? <sighs> I thought that was it for me but oh my queen would you look at this fabulous data there's nothing fabulous about it you ruined our entire day oh but it <clears throat> was worth it I've never seen such high energy reactions and that transformation we didn't even transform once. Not even a flame clock unleashes energy like that. It's a scientific marvel, is what it is. There's no getting away from it. Ouroboros are walking ether channels. And yet, despite that, this is not how we work. Caspar, what are you doing here? Since you left the Levness, with the Levness, it was hard to guess what you were up to. And you... <clears throat> are you sure 
you want to disappoint Reza. He'll throw you into a river again. No, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I had to do it. My results speak for themselves. The subjects are composed of unknown energy. If we can find a way to harness this energy efficiently, we can revolutionize the way we live. I want to bring hope to us all, and I want to do it during my lifetime. You can't exploit someone and call it hope. Now give back... Now give back what you took. Meep. Supply distribution author authorization restore. Looks like everything is as it was. Are you doing this research to help everyone? Hmm. Sorry if I hurt you. That's okay, I understand. Can't believe this. You'd better be thank you better be thankful to Mio here. I am. I am. Go on, have this. There you go. Titanium Temple Guard. This is pretty valuable. Can we really have it? Yeah, of course. I'm not going to use it, am I? So, you should use it and report back on its effects, okay? Is this another experiment? Y you aren't even sorry, are you? Sorry, she's a... She's a bit of a one-trick po ponyo when it comes to research. I'm going to research some research methods that won't make everyone so angry with me. Thanks in advance for your cooperation. Is that that quest done? Oh, so that's how they're doing. <laughs> Meep. <laughs> <coughs> One finish. No. Sure, I can lend you a hand. <laughs> you just leave things to me. Sure, I can lend you a hand. Okay, what else do we have for quests? <laughs> New developments. Um, let's move here, I guess. Okay, what do we got going on here now? Ah, uh, there you all are. I'm so happy you're still breathing. I heard what happened. Sorry to hear you got involved in this kind of mess. Ah, uh, yeah, that's what we came here to talk about. Right, I see. I suppose you must think I'm the culprit. It's so obvious, anyone would. But I didn't do it, I swear. You have to believe me. Or so he claims, but... Who else could have done it, if not him? Can you wait a bit before you decide to punish him, Boliars? Why do you ask me that? If he didn't do it, he, as he says, then the real culprit must still <coughs> be out there somewhere, no? 
Yeah, I suppose. Are you saying you're gonna try and catch them? Ah! I should point out, though, this isn't your response to... <laughs> no, what? Never mind. I'll stop being an idiot now. I mean... Uh, okay, if you say so. I don't know if I'll believe you. Alright then, I'll leave the investigation in your capable hands. Where I keep an eye out on Laszlo here. I'm sorry, I hate to put you out like this. Don't worry, we'll try and straighten this all out. Lightly sent to me, me oh love, but how exactly do you propose we do that? We should gather info at the very least. Let's check out any places we think could be somewhat relevant. Yes, exactly. Let's look for clues no matter how trivial, trivial they may seem. Okay. Uh... <coughs> Wait, what was it called? Beyond Mercy and Revenge. Okay. Oh, we actually can land on these. Hello there. Hey. <clears throat> Hello, Chandra. We wanted to ask you about the poison. Before you do, let me take this opportunity to apologize. Apologize for what? The neurotoxin you were given came from the medical team's storage. Really? Well, it was not meant it was not meant as a toxin really, but it's supposed to be a pain relieving medication but if you overdose well then well can you guess who could have been that took the substance from your stores well it goes without saying that the medic team and I can access it there's only other the only other people I can think of are the soldiers and the technician squad. They often take some of it on missions and use any on their wounded soldiers. I've warned them about it many times, but I can never be too strict with them. They are putting their lives on the line for us. So the poison came from the medic team. It really was an inside job by a Colony 4 member. The Poisoner. Why Kukukcha have never ever met someone so rude? Hey, hey, you friends! What? Kukucha, bend your ear, f bend your ear f a minute. What's up? Something wrong? Kukucha saw a soldier in kitchen earlier, sneaking around all creepy-like. So Kukucha say, please not to go in there super duper politely. Then he say to Kukucha, shut up, and then shove me, <coughs> and shove me, and ran off like zoom. Then Kukucha fell flat on bottom. It's still sting now. I see. That sounds rough. That person had such bad nature. Kukucha is lead, is squad leader. Surely have er, earned some respect. Kukucha is sure they came to uh, 
pilfer first rate fillet of Lanslo Laszlo. What greedy manners. Oh so he meant the he went in the kitchen when Lanzo was cooking. That right. That right. <clears throat> that is right, that is right. That is relevant for something. Did you catch a glimpse of his face? Of course, but me forgot it about three ticks later. I don't know who this guy was, was but he sounds mega suspicious to me. A rude soldier in the kitchen. Let's keep that in the back of our minds for now. I heard what happened at the canteen. That can't have been fun. We're looking for clues right now. Could you tell us if any... If you know anything? Yes, of course. I'll tell you everything I know. First of all, the meat you all eat came from a giant armu that the technician squad procured. Usually that kind of catch is examined bef by us before we hand it over to Kukucha and the culinary team. There was no funny business like putting poison on the armu meat when we were looking at it. So you mean the meat was first rate when you saw it? Eh? Eh? Santa, keep it in your pocket. This is just guesswork for me, but I think the meat was probably poisoned after we handed it to the kitchen. So you're saying that it's more likely the poison was added in the cooking stage. That's what I think anyway. It's purely conjecture, though. So maybe it really was Laszlo. Hey, we still don't know for sure. There's might still be a, some other clues around. I've been craving some downtime. <clears throat> hey, so can we talk? Let's summarize all the information we've gathered so far, then. First of all, the poison used in the attack is a medicine purloined from the medic team. We also know there's a high chance it could. Uh, a chance the poison was put in during cooking. So that soldier from another unit must have slipped it into the kitchen and done it, then. If Laszlo really isn't the baddie, then that person be mega suspicious. But we still have no idea who that could even be. Let's go over the facts carefully one more time. The people who had access to the poison are the medic t medical team and the technician squad. And then there's was a soldier in the kitchen with a bad nature, according to Kukucha. Are there any bad-natured soldiers in the medical team or technician squads? Oh, Sparks! W what's wrong, Senna? Mimi, I know. I know who the culprit is. What? It had to be him. I don't know about the medical team, but in the technician squad, there is one bad-natured soldier. Oh, I know who you mean. <clears throat> it must be that guy, yeah. Oh, him? I remember him. He's a soldier who randomly started butting heads with us. He could get his hands on the poison and we could all we all know his bad nature he also told Mio to watch out for poison before it sounds like it sounded like kind of a, it sounded kind of like a threat 
That has to be our guy. No doubt about it. Wait a minute, Senna. We still don't know for sure. He was openly hostile to us, so there's a clear motive there. Crap. He won't get away with this. Just wait till I find that mutter. I said wait. Mio was mad. Mio. Calm down, everybody. Let's talk to Laszlo one more time first. I'm sure he's been anxiously waiting to hear what we have to say. Y yeah, you're right. Hmm. You okay, Mimi? Alrighty. <coughs> Oh, there's a lot of people over here. Those Colony 4 mutters sure like to crack the whip. Working us to the bo snuffing bone. You're telling me the soldiers have here have to put up with this crap this whole time? Can't believe no one snapped. Looks like you got all your stuff bundled up there. You heading out or something? Got told to transfer to Colony 9. One of the higher-ups wanted me gone, I reckon. Wasn't exactly f a friendly neighborhood anyhow, but hey, it's not like it'll make any difference. Oh, well there he goes. Oh, god damn it. Now I gotta go to Colony 9. Ah, uh, That's kind of annoying. Should've saved, man. I should've saved and reloaded. I want to see what the other guy had to say. catch the culprit before we go about that we need to ask do you know Jeremy the, the tactician oh yeah of course we're in the same term wait are you telling me he's the culprit we're not certain yet but there's a high possibility it's him yes no way I mean, yes, way. He's certainly capable of such a thing. Indeed. I... He didn't seem too keen on us before. <laughs> You're not the only ones. I have a feeling he's not too fond of me either. Uh, I actually used to belong to the technician squad before but got injured in battle and transferred to the kitchens. Back then, my two teammates were Jeremy and my dear friend uh, Mercut Mercutio? Wait. Is that the soldier who fought against Colony Sai and Jeremy probably hates me just as much as Agnes, who killed our friend. Just for taking you guys in. <coughs> <coughs> so that's why he tried to pin the blame on you after trying to poison us. Alright, we get the picture. We can hear the rest after we catch him. Wait, hold on. Please let me come with you. Um, 
Weren't you under arrest? It's okay, you can go. I'll take responsibility. Just sort out the, this mess. Sort this mess out. Acting Commander, thank you so much. In that case, we just need to find out where he is. It's probably quicker to ask Captain Maxi where he is, since he's Jeremy's superior. Good thinking. Let's hurry and catch this miscreant. miscreant. No! Oh no. No, no, no. <clears throat> That's not good. Bro, if I lost my progress, I'm going to be so mad. Oh, this is not good. Okay, where do we leave off? Oh, I knew I should have saved earlier. Okay. Uh. Just going to run recon on the canteen. Okay, so it's good that we have saved here. Okay. So we just have to skip this. <clears throat> it's good that we... <coughs> can just do this. I sure hope it doesn't do the same thing. Okay, that was really weird. That was the first time... That was the first time that Xenoblade 3 crashed for me. Captain Maxi, do you have... Do you know where Jeremy is? Oh, hello, Laszlo. I heard... I thought I heard Boliars took you into custody. We'll explain the details later. Can you please tell us where Jeremy is first? He's on patrol duty with Yord. It seemed quite urgent. Plan Rana. <clears throat> Take this lot down to down route uh, 3C and convene with Jeremy's patrol uh, post haste. Got it. They should be near Dogna Desert. It takes it's a bit of a trek, so bear with. If you're again? Okay, if you say so. Okay, let's see. <laughs> hmm. 
What's going on? You're deep. What's wrong? What happened? And where the snuff is Jeremy? And where is that snuffing Jeremy? Uh, Jeremy, he... When he saw you approaching, he suddenly spiraled and into, into a complete panic. Then he whacked me on the head, probably trying to knock me out. Ugh. That arsehole. How could he do this to his own patrol mate? He won't get away with this. <coughs> Take it easy, uh, Flavron. You're just taking... You just take care of Yord's wounds for now. We'll go chase after Jeremy. Someone know somebody needs to look after her. Now look here. Alright, understood. Just be sure to give him a whack upside the chin for me. You hear? <coughs> Let's go follow him. Well, we still can. I see his footprints. Come on, hurry. Let's follow them. Everyone is not too happy with Jeremy. Okay. Where the heck did he go? <coughs> oh, he's over here. He's a smart one. <laughs> Jeremy! Gah! Hey, you haven't been in the front... <coughs> on the front lines in a while, have you? Just hang back. Huh? Are you trying to help him? Yes, we'll deal with this later. <laughs> we'll deal with this. Alright, I'll stay out of your way. Jeremy, 
You put the poison in their food, didn't you? <laughs> so you figured it out. If you're gonna kill me, just hurry up and do it. Stop talking nonsense. You know... <clears throat> Mercutio wouldn't have wanted this. What the snuff do you know about him? You just ran away fr from the fight, coward. You don't get a say. <clears throat> uh. You're a traitor to your friends, setting, s <clears throat> setting the past aside like that. Like, like you've plain forgotten about Mer Mercutio. He'd be ashamed of you kissing up to the enemy like that. Y you're wrong about me. As I, all I did was whatever you might think none of that is an excuse to lash out against your comrades. I'm not listening to a word a snuffing Agnian has to say. Mimi! I wasn't joking when I said you can shoot me if you want to. Shut up. <coughs> I don't want to hear any more. <coughs> But looking at you now, I'm pretty sure you won't shoot. Shut your trap! If you want me to kill <clears throat> you that badly, I'll make sure I finish the job this time. Hmm. Mm. Crap, snuff it all. Why? How did it come to this? What did I do wrong? Are you saying I'm the traitor? My friend was killed. I can never forget that. Why can't I shoot? Oh, snuff it. Hmm. I'll take Jeremy back to the colony. It's okay if I take over from here, right? I'm sorry, Laszlo. It's not your fault. Actually, it's nobody's fault. It's the war's fault. But at, but at some point, somebody's going to have to put an end to all that, hopefully. I'm talking about you, Ouroboros. I'm sure he gets that too. <sighs> It's not my place to ask this, but will you please come back to check on us? Yes, of course. <clears throat> oh, so that's how they're doing. Okay, um, might have time for one more quest. <coughs> Let's do that one, I guess. I gotta go. So gotta go to the city. Um, 
I think here would probably be a good place to go, right? Okay, well, it's close. Okay, let's see here. I thought it crashed again. That scared me. <laughs> Okay. Looks like we're getting nowhere. Or it looks like we're getting somewhere. We've got to start thinking about our next move. So keep contact to a minimum. Got it. Oh. Huh? See you then. You're home. I'm sorry. I didn't go meet... I'm sorry I didn't go to meet you. No problem. <clears throat> it's only a flying visit. Oh. Is... It is, is it? Anyway, I see you've brought your friends. So I'll get dinner. <clears throat> but first, let me introduce myself. I'm Rosanna. I'm pleased to meet you. Where? Oh, I know who you are. He never shuts up about you. Really? Don't flatter yourselves. That doesn't make us buddies, got it? Anyway, that's enough of that. Let's go. <clears throat> Let's all... <clears throat> What's with all this bluntness? Aren't you supposed to at least like this woman? <laughs> what do you say to that, Gray? Uh, but it's true. We're, we are partners to put it into terms you'd understand. Oh, before I forget, a work thing came up for you, Gray. What thing? Request for Monica. I'll... I'll take you there. Monica? Monica and I are good friends. This way, just follow me. Oh, so that's how they're doing. <clears throat> Partner Partners mutual. Grown-ups tell us not to fight, but all they ever do is argue with each other. Why is that? I bet we could all live just fine without the six houses stuff. Oh, we finally get... We're probably gonna get that... Oh, no, never mind. <laughs> Where are you going, Rosanna? Here is fine. Rosanna, you come. We waiting for you. And you bring Grey too. 
I did. What's going on? Mr. Salmon, did you want something from us? That right. Drum Drum is apprentice of Salmon, and we have favor for ask. It true. Oh, with it then. Please allow Drum Drum to explain. Right now, Drum Drum and Master Pawn working on Levness repair and getting ship ready. A very important job ordered by Monica. Get to the point. We have trouble lacking in material in recent day. Do you want us, <coughs> us to scrounge some for you? That long and short of it. So this kind of stuff so this kind of stuff is your job too? I thought it was just point guns at us. <laughs> so what are these materials you need? Oh, you know Hull, Hollis, the doctor. What about him? He has some things to in stock that these two would like to get a hold of. Wait, going to the doctors? Could you not have just done that yourselves? When we walk in public, they're <clears throat> always, anno always annoying people who say all kinds of things to us. They do, do they? They do, don't they? And then you have the conservatives and the hardliners. Yeah, I mean, you are different, so of course they not like you. So we'd like to ask you to do it. <clears throat> what is this? It's sending our suitability powers for friends to do the job for you. To keep annoying loudmouths quiet. That's what it is. If Gray's on the case, people will think twice about interfering, yes? Yes, exactly. I'll go too. There are things I'd like to talk about. Okay. Then we'll go too. I'm glad to hear it. My husband can be a little tactless some, so I'd appreciate it if you, you'd help him. You talk too much. Let's go. It's going to update the husband now, right? Or has a request. <clears throat> Prentice. I've always hated the eclipses. Someone's friend or family would always be slaughtered. All just to make us feel cowed and small. But this year, you saved everyone from that fate. It doesn't mean only the prisoners. You saved me too from stewing in my own juices about how powerless and defeated I was. <coughs> The future can change, and we can change it. I want to do something to help too. Whatever I, whatever I can do for the future's sake. <clears throat> she just kind of no clip through the door. Ah, you lot, what's going on? We came to take some stuff back to someone's place. Where is it? Whoa, he doesn't beat around the bush. 
Ah, Gray. I didn't s see you there. Came to pick up the materials you have. Rosanna too, eh? Thought yourselves real troublemaker, a real troublemaker here, folks. What kind of trouble? <clears throat> Rosanna, you're a right firecracker, I guess. I can't refuse. Given the debt I owe you. <coughs> Let's pack it in with the prattle. Hand over their goods and we'll go. Okay, fine. We'll get it delivered to you, don't worry. Thank you, doctor. Sh should we really be doing this? Nothing to worry about. I'll send it <coughs> to you by a route of no fraction, you know, faction, no other fact that no other factions will be will be watching. Now let's get back. No, Gray, wait. There's something I want to do, you to do. Take down some. PP toes on the great swords hilt and get me some medicine ingredients. I'm short staffed at the minute and it's hard to keep track of our ingredients stocked up. I can do that. I'll get it done soon. I'd like to chat with the good doctor a while so you don't so you be careful out there, okay? We'll go with you. It'll be easy with <clears throat> all us on the case. Sure, why not? Oh, so that's how they're doing. So it looks like we gotta go down below. Okay. Oh, looks like there's some over here. <laughs> Okay, let's see if there's any more. There's another one over there. This isn't worth our time. All set and ready to tumble. Collect this ether. Ooh, that's a lot of ether. Okay. Something so valuable here.
Oof, that was close. Okay. Wrap. Okay, <clears throat> it's just that last one we have now. Now there's another container over here. Okay, let's see where it is. Oh, is this a new region? Looks like this is where the oh, it is a new region. The cavity. Never been here Shattered pathway. Oh, there are level eighties here. We've been all over, haven't we? Oh. Okay. Something so valuable here. Okay, so where is it? Oh, it would be over here. Oh my. Uh, I don't think we can actually get that. Yikes. Okay, uh... Okay, uh... Uh-oh. I think they just gave me the side eye. Yep, that stuff. Yeah, we can't get that yet. But I think... I do want to take a look around here, though. In the cavity. Something so valuable here. <clears throat> Because I think there's going to be some good stuff in the cavity, right? Oh crap, that's death. I should have done more. I don't believe this. Be a dangerous foe. A little bit. Okay, we actually. Now there's a strong opponent. That's a uh, level ninety unique monster. Okay, then. Daunting, but we won't back down. 
Yes, we actually will. <laughs> oh, there is another container over here. I am glad I decided to come and explore a little bit. I think we can be able to get this either channel. It's a lot of ether. We'll be good on ether for a while now. Swoop to Noah. Better put our backs into it, or else. That's quite rare. That it rocks. You want me to leave? Leave it to me. Okay. What else do we got over here? It's a level ninety. No. All under control. Okay, keep going, Mew. Keep going. <laughs> keep running. Okay, what does this container have? Ultra pure gemstones? No, just pure gemstones. Really? <clears throat> Thought for sure it would have been ultra pure in this area. Guess not. Um. <clears throat> Okay. What do we got in here? Because it looks like over here. That's quite rare. Okay, so there's another container in here. I don't think we should get aggro in these. Okay, what do we got in this container? Let's just sneak a peek. Ultra pure? No, just pure. Okay, there's one monster over here. I want to check to see if that's unique. No, but it's guarding. I'll take point. That it looks like it's quadring. No, it's, it's not. We're planning on fighting that. Oh, this looks serious. Just keep running, Noah. Okay. It's another container over here. Would I be able to actually get that? <clears throat> nope, can't get it. <clears throat> we actually might be able to. Oh, we can get it, definitely. No! Come on, man. 
Just want to get this container. Is that so much to ask? Like, jeez. Okay, as long as it turns around. Come on! How did you even see me? I agree. Okay, I want to get that other thing though. I'll do my best. Mm. If we go down there, we'll die. No! This is not where I wanted to go. I should have done more. <sighs> Oi, how are we meant to fight that? I think it was yeah, it was down this way. So Daunting. Well, we do it back down. <clears throat> okay, keep on going. Come on, who else? All under control. Okay, let's finish up this quest for Grey. Uh, there should work, I guess. Okay. Managed to get what you asked. <coughs> Is this what you needed? Perfect, thank you. Make a quick work of that. I guess your old I guess your old hands at it. <coughs> and the materials. I already transported out of here. No worries about that. I see. Where's Rome's Zana? She's probably gone home. That would make sense. Well, shall we go see her? And see her? Yeah, let's. You're home, I see. Yeah. Dinner is ready. Would you like some? Can we? I wouldn't be offended otherwise. I wouldn't have authored otherwise. 
No need, I'm heading back out. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. I always thought partners would be nicer to each other. It's fine. This is just who he is. If you say so. But take care of your old bones, you hear? I know what you're like. That's my line. <clears throat> Don't throw your back out. What does that mean? None of your business. I'll be fine, dear. I'm an engineer, and I'm very pop a very popular one at that. But I always know where to uh, to come back to. Okay then. I won't be home for a little while, but <clears throat> I know. I'll see you. I'll take down these idiots and get the city back on stable ground soon enough. <coughs> I know, and I'll be doing my part to help as well. I have no idea what's going on, but at least they seem to be getting along. <laughs> we get along fine. Gray has trouble expressing himself, but he likes you, you know. <laughs> Is this true, Gray? Do you like us? I can tolerate you when you're not being a nuisance. I promised him, my life friend. Well, that took a turn. Look after him, will you? <clears throat> Leave him to us. Well, keep him fed and watered. Wait, there's something I forgot to say. What? You can take your eye patch and mask off when you're in the city. No one's going to be surprised to see your face at this point, are they? I'll think about it. Gray took off his mask. Married. <laughs> oh, he did take off his mask. Hmm. Okay. <coughs> hey, dearest. Got a minute for me? Sure. What's going on? You remember what we talked about? So help me, Gray. You mind sparing us the scowl? You're making them nervous. I highly doubt that. No, uh, actually you are. <laughs> there you have it. There's no helping this guy. Stubborn as they come, he is. Oh, yeah. You were, uh, married, weren't you? Oh, I didn't know you knew each other. This lady, she's Grey's partner, right? <laughs> yes, that's right. <coughs> what about babies? You guys got any babies? <laughs> yeah, um... <clears throat> <laughs> so it seems that even the unflinching Grey can be caught unawares. <laughs> can we be done with the tomfoolery? Just tell me what you wanted, and quick. It's about the investigation. It was still ongoing until recently, but... Wait. Someone could overhear us if we do this here. I'll prepare a secure location. We can talk <coughs> in more detail then. What are we even talking about? Nothing that concerns you. Actually, I'm thinking of asking for their help. What? They've been very cooperative in matters like this one. I think you'll find their assistance beneficial. Well, I will. Will I? Well, all right. Right then. Rosanna, you can fill them in. Sure thing. Thanks, Monica. <coughs> A hero quest. Payback for treason. Right. Nobody should bother us here. 
Now let's hear it. Okay. Well, we've been investigating for a while, and we discovered some suspicious activity from some of our own city folk. What suspicious activity? Is it the conservatives? My husband here initially asked me if I could do something about the hardliners' aggressive policies. We knew those guys were up to no good, so we were trying to take precautions. Well, listen to this. Apparently, the hardliners might be using city technology to nefarious ends. Of course. It sounds like something was stolen from R&D. And we expect that that something will be abused to further their goals. Now, we can't say what those are exactly. What could have driven them to this? You have to understand. This place isn't as monolithic as it might seem. Some folks take a really inflexible stance towards issues they might have. No matter how small. That's the long and short of it. Yes, it's just that this time, the problems have come to a head somewhat. We like to avoid unrest within the city as much as is reasonably possible. So I asked my husband for guidance. And additionally, I figured that you might lend your assistance as well. Oh, I see. So that's what's going on here. Yes, of course we'll help. <laughs> Although you know you could have come to us with this in the first place, right, Gray? <laughs> Sorry about my husband. You know, he's not the most communicative type. Understatement of the year. Huh. It just struck me. Gray's all wrinkly. <laughs> you're not. Oh. Oh, <laughs> you're right. I'm a lot younger than he is, so that's <coughs> certainly part of it. Right, honey? <sighs> Come on, talk to us, Gray. Communication. You must have heard of it, at least. I know he looks like a right grump. He's a good bloke, really. That furrowed brow comes with age, too, I'm sure. Do I have to endure this much longer? <laughs> now I get it. I did wonder how a guy like Grey could cope in a place like this. You keep him on the straight and narrow. Oh dear, you really think so? <laughs> in any case, those things you collected also seem to have gone for a walk. So in short, you want us to take them back by force? There you go again, just asking for trouble. No need, I'm sure we can resolve this amicably. What I wanted to ask you is if you could collect some more. Some more of what, exactly? Oh, do you mean those things Grey was gathering? Yes, that's right. We've got an approximate location, so let me give you that first. We can handle this, no problem. Looks like we're doing this, G-Dog. Time to saddle up. <laughs> yes. I'll do some looking myself as well, I reckon. <coughs> Don't throw you back out. That should be my line. You're always so reckless. I know. I know. <sighs> so Gray's what passes for a good bloke around here, huh? I told you not to maunder on. We are going to Daedal Isle. So it looks like <coughs> looks like uh Full Metal Jaguar will be able to move up a line. Can we open it? Nah. Nah. So it looks like we have another hero quest for Grey, so it'll be twenty Level 20 can reach. I've been craving some downtime. Mm, can't do anything there. <coughs> Much better. So I guess that will be it for today then. Thanks for all those who stopped by and had some ch chat about. Might be back tomorrow. Maybe. I don't know. Not sure yet. We'll see. Anyways, until then. <laughs>